Hello guys, Sergio here playing Age of Empires 2. Well, this is the Conqueror's campaign and I'm gonna play Attila the Han uh, sub campaign somehow. And this is mission five, the Catalonium Field. And now, said Father Ramond, is where I entered the story. The battle between Hun and Roman was fought at the end of June 451. The Romans were commanded by Aishas, <coughs> a brilliant and celebrated general who had been held hostage by Attila when he was a boy. Aishas knew Attila and knew the Hunnic ways. Since he had returned to the Western Empire, Aishas had done more than any man to keep Rome alive throughout the period of barbarian invasions. His army was not large enough to face Attila alone. So Aishas convinced tribes of the Alans and Visigoths to ally with him. Even though these dubious allies had a common hatred of the Huns, it was still a remarkable achievement on Aishas' part to have drawn them into an effective military relationship. The Huns were eager for battle. Attila's shamans looked at the entrails of cattle and the color of sheep bones and prophesied that the Huns would meet defeat on the Catalonian fields. However, they also foresaw that the commander of the opposing force would be killed. Attila must have thought this a fair trade, because he brought battle to Aishas and the Goths. Before blood was drawn, Attila stood before his assembled troops, clutching the sword of Mars in his fist. He told them, it is a right of nature to glut the soul with vengeance. I shall hurl the first spear at the foe. If any man can stand at rest while Attila fights, he is a dead man. Nice, so defeat the Roman Alans and the Visigoths. These are my men. Let's make the town center there, for example. And... Let's scout the area. Let's get one there. With those bad boys, let's go downwards. <clears throat> this is my ally. What's that? What's this? Corpses. Oh, no. Let's also kill this boys. Do we have any chances? Anyway, let's get the ships there. Where is my man? Nice, I'm destroying the Visigoths. That's a rush. Okay, I guess it's time to build the barracks. Attila, you brought us to this accursed battlefield. Now, you must keep the Romans from killing us all. What's wrong with you? Okay, now I need to slaughter the remaining workers. Oh, 
Holy cow. Holy cow. to see where are the bridges and what ways can my enemy use to Kill that wild pig. here and here and all the way here no oh that bridge is broken but On that that one found these are green and these are light blue okay now I can see the difference I 
Great this guys. But first Finally, let's go to Imperial Age. That's that's gonna give us a uh, very strong knight. I think I misplaced my... Uh nice. My, uh, my town center, I should have placed it here near this uh, forage bush. But, well... What the hell is this? How dare they? They have a lot of guts. <laughs> they are just walking by around here, nothing else. I'm gonna make just few, few more because soon I will uh, have to upgrade. Oh, nice! The pig wasn't that strong after all. What else can we build? The blacksmith. That's outrageous. Let's make them even stronger. I can build a wonder. 1000 wood, 1000 gold, 1000 stone. Nice. This, this. Have church, I don't have a market. Let's build it. Oh, nice. Look at my 
knights now. They look even better. And they will look even more better. Just wait to see the improvements I'm gonna give them. Does my ally have a market? Yes, he does. Okay. Let's trade with him. Oh yeah, and let's make uh, Tarkons. They are good against buildings. Missile units except gunpowder units have plus one attack strength. Now, okay, let's build a few more farms. food yeah I should have paid more attention to the food production sixty food sixty gold let's make some tarkans as well Okay, it's working. Look, I'm getting old. That's nice. This river will run red with the blood of Gauls and Romans. Which river? Oh, this river. They look pretty cool though. City, I guess. Nice. Forgot about that worker.
Okay, I want to reach the population limit. And then I'm just going to attack. 60 hit points, 100. Uh, it's not that they are strong. My archers are weak. Okay, let's research the stuff. This is called Moiety Trading Fee to 50%. Nice. So, let's go there. And there. We are going to get rid of this. Get inside their uh, castle. <sighs> Let's use the Tartans to take down the castle. Two castle, actually. down pretty fast I didn't lost any any knights yet nor any Tarkans that's amazing let's get these boys there and the priest there. Come on, destroy that. And that. I'm gonna focus the barracks and stuff like that. Defeat the Romans, Lance, and Visigoths. Uh, they have 
a few more hobos here. Some destroyed battering rams. Anything else? No. Let's research some things for the priests. Uh, let's see, monks again fade faster, monks and converting monks, monks move faster. Yeah, sure. Nothing else will do. Use some trebuchets now. Hmm. I'm gonna build mine here. Gold supplies are running out. Nice, I'm getting still 20 gold. Alright. That's a good deal. Let's make a lot more. Oh, population limit reached. This is neutral. I'm not going to attack them. This is also neutral. I should have had two. All right. I saw the second one. Never mind. Convert this. <laughs> nice. <sighs> okay, goats are my allies. Franks. Okay, I need to take down the Vikings, the gods, and the Roman Empire.
going to use the treble shells to destroy the castle. Catapults to destroy uh, this guy. Oh, things are going better than ever. These are the Vikings. Take them out. Oh wait, wait, wait. Workers, let's kill them. to see we have to see what there is the uh, Byzantine Empire or whatever uh, let's see what's here another town center or something I guess not I did his job. He helped me. He did a fine job. Let's go and destroy the church. Okay, I guess I have to kill him. Okay, Western Roman Empire is defeated. The Osgoths, the red guys. What? The Alans. The Vikings. Where are they? Oh, 
Are these the Vikings? I guess yes. Or I don't know. Let's destroy some enemies. Okay. Anyway, the Western Roman Empire is destroyed. That's certain. These are the island. Yeah, the Vikings. They were hiding here. I'm gonna take them down. I mean the blacksmith. Hmm. Destroy the archer range. Start to the new base. Okay, there. Now I understand. No, those are my allies. Yeah. I see what's happening here. Castle. They wanted to build a castle. Oh. The Romans have lost. Now there is nothing to stop our invasion of Italy. Indeed. Okay, we managed to kill all the enemies. That's great. That's simply great. It was a catastrophic battle. One of the largest and greatest the world has ever seen. The stream was turned to a torrent by the rushing of blood. I pity those that were forced to slake their thirst from it. Cadavera vero inumera, the Romans said afterwards. Truly countless bodies. Perhaps 300,000 men were left dead on the Catalonian fields. It is said the ghosts of those killed continued to fight for several days. I passed within inches of the fell Hun King as he stalked the battlefield, trying to determine which of his chieftains and allies yet lived, when he found me huddled beneath my shield. I made my peace with God, but Attila did not seek my decapitation. He saw that I was a holy man and ordered me to join his retinue of foreign advisors. That is how you know so much of the Huns, I offered. The priest nodded. Despite the carnage, the outcome of the legendary battle was unclear. Attila had lost much of his cavalry, but the Romans' entire army was destroyed. For a time, no one knew if the Hun king would continue to pursue the hand of Honoria. But what of the prophecy, I asked? Did Aishas die on the battlefield? Nay, it was Theodoric the Goth, not Aishas, who died and fulfilled the prophecy. Aishas knew that if he utterly destroyed the Huns, then the Visigoths would have no need for a Roman alliance, and Rome would face yet another barbarian threat. And so, Aishas retired from military life, hoping that the outcome of the Catalonian fields would leave the Huns and Goths in a stalemate hoping that he had done enough 
to save his empire. He had not. Oh, quite a good story. Guys, thank you very much for watching and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more videos with Age of Empires 2 and other games. See ya!